The Department of Municipal Affairs gave away awards to 27 town beneficiaries of the Bratan Mandri Awas Yojana Housing for All Urban Mission at Hotel Jafu in Gohima with Dr. Nigi Saleh Gire, Advisor for Urban Development and Municipal Affairs, as special guest. Speaking at the program, Dr. Nigi Saleh Gire said, the scheme is being implemented by the Ministry of Housing and Urban Affairs. In Nagaland, the number of dwellings sanctioned by the ministry is 31,241, it was informed. He said, out of 32 towns in the state, 29 towns in the scheme are doing well. He urged the beneficiaries to set an example to others in transformation for a better tomorrow. <laughs> You are showing a big difference to the people. It for other, it encourages others to also do what they are expected to do. Now I can go at the heart banana like this. Although that heart is we just add some more hair and make a new one. It doesn't make a difference. Among the other like the pakta gourmet like this, the the fun comedy by the way don't. Complain on that. Abna pille parabi kiman kuri wo pare. You want to have a change in your setup. That is the change that you are going to bring. Itu kane. I want to congratulate all those who are going to be given the award. Bal para kam kuri dia lagado. I want to congratulate all of them. So manobi kuri thagi lemi. So to ekki huse kubo nori wo. I feel like I I hope nobody is partial when they went to see which are the buildings. Also, the head of the Municipal Affairs Department, Jenny Tung Lota, said the PMAYU has brought changes to the lives of the people in the country. He said that more than 122 lakhs houses have been sanctioned in the country of which 300 plus houses were sanctioned for Nagaland. Everyone is a winner and there will be many more awards in the near future. While congratulating the, in advance the winners, I would like to request the team members to continue give the best to achieve the set targets within the time and also um, pass the message across to the beneficiaries who are yet to complete the houses. Take advantage of this uh, scheme. Tamjin Renla Gechu, State Mission Director, PMAYU Mission and Joint Director of Municipal Affairs also said that the journey of PMAY Urban Mission has been of challenges, milestones, sentiments and empowerment. She said many urban poor lives have been changed for the better and many families have been provided buka houses. She informed that the targeted goals to achieve the completion of houses construction under this by the end of December is 1500 houses. Bungro town is the only town in the state with 100% completion of the construction of houses under this scheme. Just a short introduction of the PMAY uh, mission till now in Nagaland. Uh, so far we have 31,241 houses uh, sanctioned by ministry. Out of this, uh, with the help of our beneficiaries and our surveyors and everybody in this mission, till today we have completed 6,520. Actually, this mission was supposed to be completed by this year, June. However, because of the pandemic, it has been extended by one more year and we are hoping to achieve 15,000 completed houses by March next year. And in fact, that is our target, but we hope to achieve even more than that.